Brazilian bomber who just charges home and is now the Diamond League champion. Brilliant. She is so strong, doesn't she? Isn't she? She, I suppose, it looks like she accelerates through the last 50 or 60. I think actually what she does is just hold her form better than others. Steve, here around the crown of the bend, of course, 50 or 60 meters, she's possibly in about last place. She doesn't start well out of the blocks at all. Kambunji in the middle in five. Dina Asher Smith gets out very strongly indeed. Sharika Jackson trying to chase her. Kambunji started very quickly. A bomber just a few meters down, but will chase him in the home straight. That's a sure. It's Dina Asher Smith leading at the moment, but here comes Sharika Jackson. The Jamaican's got the lead, but a bomber is charging. A bomber's coming very, very quickly, and she just gets it on the line. 21. 200 here as well. But a bomber. Just watch how she finishes so strongly. You'd expect that from somebody with such good 400 meter strength. Sharika Jackson, can she show what might have happened in the 200 meters had she not been so silly in the qualification? Dina Asher Smith in lane seven. So Jackson six, Asher Smith seven, and Bomber four. Kambunji in the middle in five. Nice package. We're going to see Christine Obama from Namibia, one of the DSD athletes who had to change event, couldn't run in the 400, her best event up till earlier this year. But what a transition to the 200 she's made and took the silver medal and ran 21.81. Now a late change here. Talu's decided not to contest the 200 after a 100-meter race. So Beth Dobbin moves up into lane 